My first wild spotting. Two two nine four. Got it. Checking on the IVs. 82, 84, nice. We'll keep this. My first wild Vaporeon catch. got this Vaporeon because of an event. Join a worldwide celebration of Pokemon originally discovered in the Kanto region. The mythical Pokemon Mew which we caught has attracted all these Pokemons. For the next one week we will be seeing more of Kanto Pokemon. The way I say it this was actually done for people who were struggling to discover the Mew. Mainly getting a golden Kanto batch and ghost Pokemons plus magic carp as well. With this event, I am very sure that many of you will be getting Mew pretty soon. Not only that, they have given limited time offers of 3 boxes. Of course, the Ultra Box is the one which I would go for because it's good value for money. 24 premium passes. And by the looks of it, it looks like they may release Shiny only through Raid Bosses. And there are no reports of Shiny until now. But you never know what Niantic does. Because. So this could well go the Halloween event way, wherein they release the shiny one by one. And they've also stated that they've been bringing back Snorlax and Aerodactyl as raid bosses. Not only that, there are few more raid bosses from Kanto region. So Tire 1 has Bulbasaur, Charmander and Squirtle. Tire 2 has Lickitung, Muck, Venomoth and Weezing. Tire 3 has Aerodactyl, Alakazam. Kabutos, Omastar, Onyx and Scyther. Tire 4 has Golem, Lapras, Rhydon and Snorlax. Of course, for players playing from long time, this event might not be that great considering that there are no shinies reported till now. Let's wait and see. Of course, uh, I am a bit happy because we are getting to see third evolution Second and third evolution Pokemons a lot. Hopefully we'll get to see more today as well. kilometer egg is hatching well something special is going to happen after this I'll be completing a new quest for the first time hatching five eggs I guess we'll be getting a chancey I'm not sure let's have a look which is the one oh, come on. six twenty okay let me try to pin up it Got it. Uh, quick check on the IVs. Attack. 15 attack. Nice. Real life. 
three vacancies over there. Well, this is a favorite part of the event for me. Double candies. You get double candies for catching, walking and transferring. So, I've been holding on to these legendaries from a long time. It's time I transfer a few of them. So, let's start. Well, it's almost closing time of the park, so we need to go out. Chansey appeared, so taking a break from transferring the Pokemons. One, one, three, four. Not sure how good it is. Anyway, we'll golden dress it. Don't want to take chance. That was a lucky excellent. <laughs> Got it first ball. Let me check on the IVs. Pretty bad one. Okay. So let me get back to transferring the legendary Pokemon.
I guess with that we are done with transferring the legendaries. Uh, not sure how many I have transferred. Should be 100. Anyway, let me count it while doing the editing. And it's quite dark right now. So it's time to head back home. Do let me know what you feel about this event in the comment section below. Personally, I feel they should release shiny Pokemons in the upcoming days. If not, this could become the most boring event of all time. And for people who are playing the game of late, this is your great chance to finish the Kanto region medals and discover Mute. All the best for that. Hope you enjoyed this video. See you soon with another Pokemon Go adventure.